best way to pass the time, in my opinion, is to play Minecraft. It is the best and funnest way to pass the time. It is a creative way to pass it, and all the modern games are just go this way, shoot this guy, but Minecraft is different. In this speech, I will tell you the versions, the history, and how to build a house. I will talk about the versions first. And Do you need that? No. Okay. The versions go from first off being a different game called Ruby Dungeon to going to the beta version. From the beta, it went from beta 1.0 to beta 1.8, and then it went to the actual version of the game. The actual version went to 1.72, which is the very first one that had dungeons, villagers, and horses, and all the new mobs. After that, they released it for the Xbox, which started at 1.65-ish. When we got it for the Xbox, it didn't have very much of the computer stuff, but they updated it. With the updates came all the new stuff that we did not have. The Xbox version sold 33,000 copies on its very first day. The computer version has sold over 12 million copies overall. All the platforms together have made 33 million cells. And now that we've talked about the versions, we will talk about the history. The game was created about five years ago by a man named Marcus. He is known by Notch, but nobody knows why. At least I don't. Um, the game was started as a hobby by him. And when he started it, he thought that he was just going to make something that he would only play. But he did not know that everybody would like this game and buy it. Now that we've talked about how to, or the history, we're going to learn how to build a house. Step one of building a house is to find a piece of land that doesn't have very much stuff on it. After you clear it of dirt, like so, you will need to build the general structure. In that general structure, you will need a floor, four pillars at least, a roof, and no walls yet. In the next step, you will have to build four things around that same structure, and just have the flooring and the floor pattern. In the next step, you will need to build walls, a window platform, a door platform, some of the roofs, and more pillars. For the next step, you will need to add glass, doors, a, a path so that you know which ways to get into your house. And in the next step, you will have to decorate all of this with either flowers, a different path, more fountains, and interior decoration. And by that I mean either a end portal, crafting tables, a TV, a bed, levers, glowstone, stuff like that. also build on the outside flower paths and if you look behind you a random colorful tower. This game is my favorite way to pass the time. It is fun, creative, and is different from every other game because it's just run and shoot and kill everybody. Thank you for listening to my speech. All right.